Hey guys, it's iVlogger and today I'm going to be showing you what's on my jailbroken iPhone. Now, this is probably going to become a series because I change my phone a lot with features and tweaks and stuff, but for this first one, it is Search Widget. And this gives you this cool little Google bar search thing. Now, when you click on the mic, it opens up Google. But if you uh, just type something, you know, just click on the, the bar itself, you can search stuff instead of having to open Safari or the Google Chrome app. And as you can see, my lock screen clock is now on my home screen, and that is with 7 o'clock. And you can see my apps are sort of themed like some sort of Galaxy apps on TouchWiz and Marshmallow, but that is just minimal.ios.8 or something like that. It's a really long name. And my carrier logo and that little uh, how strong your connection is, that is gone with Hide Me 8. And if you haven't noticed, the clock widget is not interacting at all with the apps, like normally the apps would go all the way to the top, but that has been stopped with Anchor. So when I swipe up and show my control center, as you can see, it seems a little bit darkish, and that is thanks to Dark CC. And I have many more options to click with now, and that is thanks to CC settings. And I made my control center a little bit simple, removing some of those annoying bars and boxes that are not needed with CC Clean. Now for my lock screen, as you can see, I have Barry C8. Sometimes I have to open an app quickly for whatever reason. For my lock password, passcode, whatever you want to call it, I have Android Lock XT. I just prefer that better than just pushing in a bunch of numbers. It just seems more fun. And to get that annoying big clock out of the way, I have many time. So yeah, that's basically it. I will see you on the next Jailbreak adventure. See ya.